Welcome back. We need to search for Efsha, and I think we potentially have found it over here. I mean, if not, what's the exclamation for? That's the question. Could be something else. You're late. I thought you may well have turned tail. I was trying to collect all the treasure that I could find. It's important. We couldn't help it. You told us to come all the way out here. So we had to fight tons of monsters. We did, actually. We took out the ancient dragon. Hey, Efsha, why'd you call us to a place like this specifically? You know, that might actually be a good enemy to go level up on at this point. Go to the forbidden forbidden dragon, the ancient dragon with forbidden twigs. And then just keep taking the ancient dragon out. Getting loads of XP. Seems simple enough. A place like this. It seems you truly are ignorant. Indeed, many a year has passed, and yet... Surely the goddesses recall the events that once plagued this accursed place. This is where Psychostock was born. What? As well as your hometown. Isn't that right, Efsha? Hometown. Effie, this is your... Yes. I was born and raised upon this very soil. Though, as you can well see, nothing of it now remains. Listen well, for I will, in short, tell you how terror and tragedy befell this place. On that day, the birth of Psychostock. On that day five years ago. During the early days of gaming's inception, the goddesses all threw themselves into its creation. My city's was no different. Attempting to create the ultimate game, she strayed from her path, abusing her employees and enforcing selfish decisions. Yet worse still, the goddess placed a spell upon the finished game, intended to enthrall the people's hearts, turning them obsessed. What the heck? That's the lowest thing you could do, as a creator or a goddess. That's right. I heard that the game itself was a far cry from a lauded accomplishment. Could it be? Was there a flurry of returns? No. If only it were that simple. Something even more horrifying happened. The birth of Psychostock. The resentment and pain of the overworked employees, the dissatisfied voices of the purchasers. Due to the spell placed upon the disc, that game turned into a cursed game. Stealing away the player's very humanity. I know about that story, too. It's a story passed down through generations of goddesses. You are correct. Of course, the game inspired a flood of panicked returns. The returned games piled up, creating an enormous inventory stockpile. And soon, Psychostock came to be. The other goddesses battled bitterly for dozens of days to seal it. But long before then, the place I once called home. Your lot is no different from that foolish goddess. I brought El Elring's release date up to clash with Bug Kaiser to ensure it would not once more become mass inventory. Yeah, but, but, but what you're doing is making sure it is just mass inventory if it isn't sold like you're causing it to happen again what are you doing even if i were to have done nothing i see no hope in bug kaiser's success the result would once more be a massive stockpile which may in turn give rise to psycho stock yeah but again by your very logic you're causing that if bug kaiser doesn't sell you're wrong we won't allow that mistake to happen again! I mean... That makes sense to me, right? What What are I saying? Like, that, that makes sense? Yeah? I've not missed something, have I? Oh! Not but empty words! If you would insist I accept your treachery, then prove it with blade in hand. Defeat me and demonstrate your resolve! Go on then! Hippie, 
We have no other choice. I mean, if we're starting this battle transformed, that would be very good for me. If words aren't gonna reach, we just have to force her to accept us. Uh, yeah, you're right. All right, here we go, Dit. Are we transformed? We should be. Yes. Show me the strength of your will. Right, straight into it with the skills. Keep it coming, keep it coming. He fit. Now let's get her boost. Big damage there. That boost is actually working and the chain's working. Yes. The one from Radio that we assigned is working very nice. She's got a little bit of health left then, I assume. Yep. Boom. I shall yeah. cut you down. Right there, yeah, the magic prompt. Like, we're getting the buff. But we're maintaining the change. Like, yes, it's exactly what I wanted. Acknowledge your spirit. Very happy with that skill. That's what I want. They'll be a part of my new experiment. Next time I'll finish things. Wait, status up? <sighs> to think I would be repelled once more. Yet still, I refuse to accept it. I will never acknowledge you. <sighs> Already you have returned Psychostock upon this world. You dare proclaim that such a tragedy will not occur again. But trying to avoid it coming back. If you truly feel responsible, you should remove yourselves from game development. Is that not obvious? Indeed. In truth, I thought much the same. As you say, we were wrong. Back then, we were all arrogant. We did only the things we wanted to. We never considered the feelings of those who would play our games. And so, we revived Psychostock. And the world was divided into pieces. You can't even game freely anymore. But that's why! That's why we have to take responsibility for what we've done! We want to bring the world together as one again. And to bring smiles back to players' faces! So what of it? You simply insist that you've changed. And I should recognize you for that. I mean, yeah. Yeah. We believe that we've changed. But that's not all. We have Nep Nep with us now. If we ever start to stray from our path, I'm sure that Nep Nep will stop us. After all, she enjoys gaming more than anyone. With all her heart, she would never, ever let us make a game that disregards its players. Triple dot. So saith the failure goddesses. And what have you, O oh Lord at Neptune? My feelings haven't changed one bit. I'm gonna have as much fun as I can. Playing, creating, both of them are a blast. I'm really looking forward to your LL ring too, F. Shaw. I've already pre-ordered it. Oh. What? Do you not desire to be the dominant maker? Do you not wish the entire world to play your games alone? That's not the nep we know, no. With that kind of stuff, I'd rather everyone just do what they want to. Amazing games, scary games, even the janky ones. Everyone is different, and they're all good. Yeah, but there are some really bad games that aren't even fun to play as bad games. There's a few. So you don't have to postpone your release either. Okay, F-Shop? 
If you did that, everyone who's looking forward to LL Ring would be bummed. Very well. I will allow you a while longer while I ascertain your natures once more. But remember well, if ever should come a day in which you stray from the path, I will hunt you as far as you may travel. Oh my. I see. So that's the deal. Seems I've finally got a lock on Fshaw's identity. Identity? I got to hear about the cursed game too. This is getting real interesting now. What are you up to? You got your own agenda going on. Still, I feel like all I've been doing is listening in. It's time I made a splash myself. Sploosh! Welcome, everyone gathered today. We know we've kept you all waiting, but the panel is about to begin. This is still going on. We traveled to the other side of the planet, as far as we know, the other side of the continent, at least. The other side spent some time driving around in a swamp, got into a fight, and we came back. Okay. Yay! Looks like Fshaw's not attending today. In the end, she postponed the release date of LL Ring 2. I think Evie's trying to take responsibility. That's not it. You guys have a message from Fsha. I wish to engage in gaming more earnestly. Apparently. Apparently. Um, what does that mean? That she wishes to engage in gaming more earnestly. That's what that means. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, engage in gaming more earnestly. Yeah, that definitely that, that's definitely what it means. It looks like she was originally cutting development close in order to match it with Bug Kaiser's. I mean, that's risky in itself. I mean, again, Efsha is currently on the path to making the tragedy she saw happen, happen again. I think she wanted to focus on finishing up LL Ring properly after hearing what you guys had to say. That's so. I'm kind of happy to hear it. Maybe we were wrong after all. Triple dot. All right, then. You guys will be on soon. How are you doing? Feeling any better? Don't worry. I'm pretty good at this sort of thing. Th that's good, Nep Nep. Everyone, r relax! Hmm. <sighs> Go on, Jaggy. There's something you want to say to them, right? Um, Pippi? And Neptune, too. I... Hey, Jagga. Come check out the audience. Just a little peek. I promise it's good stuff. Go on. Good stuff? Transform! Bug Kaiser! No, that's wrong! This is how you transform! No, no, kids! You don't get it! For this pose, you have to angle your arms. See? Like this! I'm imagining him doing a full-on T pose. <sighs> they said that a bunch of customers showed up today just for Bug Kaiser. Looks like that transformation pose is super popular, too. I... I see. Hey, Jaga. What made you think up that transformation pose? Was it just because you liked it? Were you just acting without thinking like we used to? I wasn't. Then what? I thought a cool pose would keep things exciting during the transformation. I was certain it would be more fun that way. I imagined it would make people smile when they saw it. And thinking that made me happy too. So I... Yeah. That's what I figured. We know now what the past us didn't. It's not like it was back then. We really have changed. Pippi. Pippi Pi. See? Look at all the kids having fun. Isn't that more important than some snotty opinions on the internet? Yeah. Yeah, you're right. I 
don't even have to calculate it. I wasn't sure how it'd go, but if Jaggy's happy, I'm happy too. Everyone from Victory, you'll be heading on stage momentarily. Please be ready. Oh, they're saying it's almost time. All right then, let's go, Jagga. Huh? Me too? I mean, you're gonna change your mind, right? Of course! Come on, let's nail that transformation pose together. That'll fire him up for sure. Right. Here we go. Transform! Bug Kaiser, metamorphosize! Hooray! It's our earnings report. Let's see the results of my calculations. My income went down. <laughs> I went down! Well, we just gotta push harder next time. It went Keep down! I did that one bit where it was like really, 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 really good. <laughs> Chapter 5. And then no. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. What the quests around? Because we've got the dream crushes and Christmas. Because I haven't handed in Christmas. But Christmas is done for. We don't seem to have any little side events around. So let's head on over to the game shop. The storefront line of Bug Kaiser starts here. We're taking people in line only. Please refrain from pushing. Please don't push. Oh God, please don't push. Oh God. Hey, hurry up and sell them already. I've been in line for three days. Slightly stinky customer. I've been waiting for a whole week. If even a single person gets injured, sales will be canceled. I repeat, if anyone's injured, Transform! Bug Kaiser, metamorphosize! Ah, uh, what the? Hey, misters, you shouldn't make a fuss inside the store. That's right, you gotta wait your turn. Yeah, yeah. Aren't you guys embarrassed acting like that in front of kids? Fix your attitudes. Uh, yeah, I don't want to be called embarrassing by the likes of you. It really is like this person's silhouette looks like one of those, um... You, you know, neck massages. Yeah. Yes. Bug Kaiser's extremely popular. The panel at the event was good, too. LL Ring's been postponed. So, yeah, everyone would buy it. We are ready to get Poggin. Yeah. Oh. We'll move on. Apparently, Bug Kaiser sold out again. We've gotten even more order requests. Again? That means you sold out at least twice. Now, probably more because we don't know how much time has passed. This time it's a different sales area. Rather, it appears we're sold out all over. All of them? No way! Radio, do we still have any inventory? Zip, zilch, nada. Just sent the last of them. Huh? I'm getting a sense of deja vu here. Um, am I about to have a bad time? Probably. President, the work's stalled over here! Hurry and do something! CEO, please assist me with these packages. Neppy! More monsters on our sales area shipping route! I knew it! Ah, I'm... So tired. Oh, we were going so quick. I don't even know who I am. But we managed to prepare the orders. <laughs> yeah. It's all thanks to you, Nap Nap. I. I knew I wasn't wrong in choosing you. Ugh. I mean, you weren't wrong. No. But it was still very, 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 very quick. Again, you still didn't know her name when you made her your president. That was still an issue. You got lucky. Pippi, stay with me, Pippi. If you fall here, what'll happen to your promise with Jaga and Radio? No, <laughs> Pippi P, no. No, seriously, please wake up. Hey, Pippi, Pippi P. 
Pippi pippi pee. Pippi pippi pip 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 pee. You had fun with that, didn't you, Melissa? <sighs> peas. <sighs> Too many peas. <sighs> She's even retorting subconsciously. She's so sweet, isn't she? Dropped right off to sleep. But it seems like she'll be out for a while. We'll have to postpone our Bug Kaiser release celebration a little longer. We can have the party anytime. It's not like we're having guests. As far as we know. Sorry to interrupt. It's us, the first makers and second sisters. Hey there, big me. Haven't seen you since the panel. Huh? Small me and the others? Even the sisters are here. We heard that Bug Kaiser had a rather successful launch and thought we might come to celebrate. Did you bring tea and cake? Maybe? We never properly thanked you for saving us from the cursed game either. You needn't worry about that, but we appreciate the sentiment. Up you go, Pippi. Everyone's come to celebrate. What uh, was wrong? Did we get more orders? Was wrong. It's way better than that. Since everyone's here and all, let's have a party to celebrate the successful launch of Bug Kaiser. I do like orange juice. It's good. <laughs> Thanks so much to everyone for gathering here today. To those in the crowd, let's crank it up a notch. Pippi, are you drunk? She's drunk on orange juice. She's just tipsy on the atmosphere. It's only orange juice. Like I said. <laughs> Thank you all so much. There were times I wanted to give in. But I kept going because you girls were there. And now she started crying. She's beginning to sound like an idol attending their graduation live. From now on, we'll make even more fun games. I promise to unite the world as one. Mm, Uni, this food is really good. Aren't you eating a little too much? It's not my fault if you put on weight. Oh my. By the way, I wanted to increase the amount of consoles we ship next month. I re-examined the semiconductor supply, and we should be able to handle a 30% increase. That's good. Next month is the rush of new titles, so I want to bolster the hardware supply to match. No one's listening to me? No. You talked too much, Pip. Don't let it bother you. For now, we'll simply hold our dream of world unification close in our hearts. Well, it's more a reunification, if anything, but okay. Hmm. Uniting the world, huh? Yes. Seisha, what's going on? Seisha, what's the situation? Isha and Esha have reached their designated locations. We're ready to begin the hunt. You're ready as well, yes? Yes, I can start any time. But, Seisha, before the infiltration, might I have a word? Sure. So long as it isn't a death flag. It's probably a death flag. Was it really alright? For us not to attend Pippi and the others' party? Oh, it's fine. We had pressing business to attend to. And besides, we're rivals, right? I'm not about to go play nice with the enemy. <laughs> Pippi would snap if she heard that. That's fine. It'd only get me more fired up as a rival. Now then, let's get to business. As we planned, I will take the vanguard. Here we go. Everyone, let's move. Nobody move. Come quietly and... Oh, wait, no one's here? If they're not here, where are they? I mean, I'm assuming this is R4's factory or whatever it is. Seems they're already gone. They may have caught wind of our plans. 
But the production line has been left behind! And this ruined device! It would appear this was the location of that device and the discs. Seashaw, there's something over here too! A stolen console and bootleg games! As we thought, this is R4's hideout. But where have they gone then? The question is, where she escaped to? You're right. Apprehending the copy trio isn't enough. We need to find R4 or the damage won't stop. We have to hurry. Everyone, wait a moment. Esha, did you find something? This is a game console, right? It looks like it's on. And what's this weird thing on it? Uh-oh. This device. I feel I've seen it before. Please wait, Esha. It's best not to approach carelessly. Ah! What's this light? Shoot. It's a trap. That did what? Whoa! Are they okay? I don't know. I guess we'll see about finding out if they're okay in the next part. Indeed. Ta-da for now.